Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. If you're not subscribing already, take this chance to like and subscribe so you can keep up with everything I'm gonna be showing y'all. Today, I'm gonna do a review of the things I got from my Boohoo haul. If you're familiar with social media and the ads for the plus size girls, you've probably seen the ad from Boohoo. So their specialty is trendy fashion for the big girls. And we know that that's what they all say until we get that stuff in the mail. And it's a 5X that's fitting like a medium. So it's always a crapshoot when we get off into ordering this stuff online. This is a COVID purchase for me. Um, I might have went overboard a little bit. We're going to see. I don't even remember half the stuff that's in here, so we're going to get into it. All that clickety-clack you might hear in the background is my dog tipping around here on his claws that are long as stilettos. I'm going to let him live. Hopefully, he'll sit down. But let's just get into it. I don't know if I was going for winter, spring, summer, fall. So as I pull these things out, we could be getting anything. Does it ever say anything? Oh, it says stuff. Okay, hold on. Plus Paisley printed shirt dress. I'm a whole for a shirt dress, so we're going to see what's up with this. The print is okay. I'm trying to get into prints more. I thought if I do the little Paisley, that would be cool. So let's see what it's talking about. Okay. So I'm about 5'2". They said this is a shirt dress. Okay, okay, I feel them, I feel them. When I hold it up, it's coming down to my kneecaps. So that looks like it's gonna be cool. I will be in certain pictures of me in these outfits and my plans to do a little commentary while I have them on. For now, we just gonna look at them. One thing I like to look at all the time with the plus size clothes is these arms. Not all plus size women are built the same. I'm one of those that got some arms on me. So I always like to see how wide that arm is. You already know it look wide. When I put it on, we might be on some toddler type stuff. This is a size, who? Who is it? This is a size 24. I wear a size 20. So I know this is probably just the size conversion because these clothes come from who knows where, but we'll see how that's going to work. First flower outfit. She looking, she checking it out, checking the tail. I mean, yeah, she like it. This was a no brainer for me. I got a lot of these. I could have let that collar down. Yeah, she Next working. Up. Hmm, I see eyelets. Is that what those little holes are called? Nah, I don't know. It's some little dainty lace work on here. I don't know, y'all. I was just doing this and doing that. Let me see what it say it is. Plus broadery, super oversized t-shirt. That's my vibe. I love a shirt dress. I love a big old t-shirt. But this is fancy. Full disclosure, this already looks too big. Plus size girls, look, I got this habit. I don't know if y'all have it too. When you're used to being plus size and always having to get the biggest of everything, sometimes we do that automatically. I might end up with egg on my face and this is going to look like a bib. But just looking at it, it look, you know, it look right wide. It look right wide. So I don't know if my back to boob ratio is going to give me the shine I want in this. Because the small chested plus size folks, y'all know what I'm talking about. Nevertheless, another shirt dress. Okay. <sighs> okay. Next up. I showed y'all this. I said it was wide and outside. Huh. I also said 
it might end up looking like a bib. We gonna see. Uh-huh. Seem wide. Still seem wide. Mm-hmm. I even left my little onesie on with it because I thought it was that wide. Okay. Promise. Okay. But then as you see how it dropped down, your girl started looking like a marshmallow a little bit. So now I got to see what I'm really going to do. See? Look at that neck. What is that neck even? I don't know about that. I think this is definitely a great white nope for me. Maybe it'll be some lounge wear. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see what else I got up in here. Red. Red is my favorite color. So I always got to pop with a piece of red off in here somewhere. This material is feeling very much my underarms may be funky in this. I want y'all to know what I'm talking about. I hope I'm not suffering alone. But sometimes some of this little old rayon or whatever this fabric is does not interact well at all with my body. And so, you know, probably in about 30 to 40 minutes, I'm sweating and I think I'm cute. And next thing I know, I'm smelling like a sack of onions. I ain't buy this. I ain't buy this. Who bought this? What? What was I thinking? What was the vibe? I don't know. What 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 were we doing? What 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 was I trying to give? What what am I? Okay. No, 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 no. Thinking outside the box is important. You don't want to fall a victim to your fashion habits. I ain't going to talk about she. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Yeah. All right, y'all. Here go the first red number. As you can see, it ended up being a romper. Who the funk? But look at this camel toe. It's a camel No. Ah, uh, these sleeves. It was also very thin. See how it let's just flapping in the wind like that? I don't know. And the spaghetti straps, and then I'm looking at my bra. I guess I could wear a bralette under this. Look at that. Can I tie it around my waist? Because them sleeves was just ridiculous. Ah, uh, this is cut from a different cloth that I just don't intend to wear. It's a no for me all the way. I'm sending her back. I don't recall that. Okay. Let me just pull the rest of this stuff out of this bag. I see a black thing. I see something else with some flowers. And another. Okay. I see one that I'm excited about, so I'm going to hold off. <laughs> the prints. You know, you got two schools of thought. The big girls shouldn't wear the prints. The big girls need to wear the prints to dress up all the fat. I wear what I want. But I do see a lot of florals in here. I, I don't even know. Also... It is not lost on me that I ain't given very much bald head scallywag. I had to do my Cleo braid down because I'm waiting on my passion twist to come from Amazon. And then I'll be installing those. This is heavy. This is like 50 p. What is this? I be ordering this stuff when I'm asleep. Not when I'm asleep. But I'm in the bed, it's nighttime. I'm trying to wind down and I be on my phone, AKA reading the paper. And I get caught up in these ads. So I'm telling y'all, boohoo, like this is looking really like a three piece suit. Uh, okay, so we got some little lounge looking pants. Y'all call them lounge pants, yoga pants, whatever. For the big girls, we is wearing these outside. I do not care, leggings is pants. All this is pants. I'm wearing it, and, and you just going to have to deal with it. If it got two legs in it, and I'm sliding it up across my thighs, it's pants. Talk to your mama. Okay. So, that's the... What is that? What? Oh. Uh. We jumping out the bando. I think this is like a bando top. It's a bando top, y'all. So let me, you know, I said it before, I'm going to say it again. 
I don't know what the small chested big girls do in these situations. Am I going to put a bralette on with that? Am I just, what, how? Tell me how I'm supposed to breathe with no air. Okay, it don't matter because it's still cute. I'm going to still try that. And I guess we're supposed to bring it all home. It's the robe. Look at that, look at that. It's not a robe, duster. Don't let me be old. Duster, so I'm gonna rock it with the duster. I don't know about the bando top. We gonna see. All right, y'all. I'm coming through with the three-piece suit. As you can see, I was already approving of this message. Now, I did leave my little bra situation on sports bra because that bandeau is a little slack. Next time I wear it, I'll get a strapless bra. I'll try something else. But, like, I was feeling it. I love this. I love the duster. I love the little stomach service. It's a win all the way. Let's get back to the flower garden. Okay, so next up. Oh, what was this called? I'm sorry. I'm supposed to be doing better by y'all. Plus rib, three-piece, duster coordinate black. That's what that was. Okay. If this says floral shirt dress, plus ditzy floral print shirt dress. Okay. Ah, uh, maybe. Okay, may I must have been thinking these are things. These are little some cute frocks to wear to work with the chair. That's what I was thinking. That's what it was for the kids. For the kids, have them think you got a sunny disposition. Put on a little flowers, a little. Give me some little Mary Janes. That's it's for the children. I never promised you a rose garden, but here go some more flowers. So you know the other one was just like this. They ain't twins, but they definitely sisters. Now, the the cuff, the buttoning of the cuff, get on your nerves. You got to take your time with that, and I didn't have any. Still love it. Love this print more than the other one. But, I mean, shoot, this will work, and I ain't wearing no Mary Janes with it neither, like I said. Fair. Oh. Uh... I remember seeing this probably about three different times. And I said, no, nah, girl, you don't need them big lemons all over you. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. I need a lemon romper. What I don't need is this gap. Oh, what? What go in here? What is this? Is this a flasher? What is, what's this? Okay, so I guess the assumption is that if you busting down a big 20, you're supposed to have you some Fs to go with it. I do not, and so, okay, I guess. A bralette is going to go under that. Otherwise, it's just all gapped open and showing this cavernous face that is my chest. We're going to see. Y'all. Lemon on a chain with the V cuts. So, this is the only item that I knew I wanted. And I was right. Now, all that gapping in the front, you know, I can rectify that with old bralette. I guess with a bunch of cutouts or some lace or something. Ain't no problem. Because this right here is cute as an entire button. I like how that looks. Yeah, and it feels good too. It's it's, it's a vibe. It's a no-brainer. I'm going to make it work. Plus size girls, that's what we do. We what? We make it work. Sometimes we stretching the fabric to its last thread just to put it on. Sometimes we tying it in a knot because it's way too big. We can make it work. We iconic like that, and why is it 
So I think this is a little bit of fall stuff that I ordered. Oh, nasty. I call it hound's tooth. I'm not sure why they're calling it dog tooth. My grandma taught me the dog tooth was when you had one tooth coming in over top of the other one. That might be some country stuff. I don't know. But nevertheless, it's been real hot. Just know that if y'all watch this and I have inserted video of myself putting this on, I love y'all because this show look hot as a dog. She cute though. Uh-huh, that's a little something casual. She, yeah, she, she all right. I regret to inform you that I thought I was doing something with this little hands to sweater. This did not have any give, any stretch. I don't know if I needed to oil up before I put this sweater on. Um, It was also kind of itchy. But I mean, you know, I was a G with it. I figured I'd go ahead and just keep trying to get it on. But it was stiff as a board. Um... I, you know, I don't have a lot to say about this sweater. Maybe if I lose three to five pounds, it'll be a little bit better. But as for now, it just, it's really not giving much. You know, when I look at a lot of these clothes, I think, mm, I could have just went to Rainbow. But I suspect it's about this much difference between a Boohoo outfit a Fashion Nova outfit, and the rainbow outfit. I don't think it's that much of a difference. That'll be a story for another time. Rainbow and their um, cockeyed shirts with the seams all askew. They be getting me. I got jeans. Okay, so look, jeans is a whole thing in the plus size community. Some of us got big old legs. Some of us got no legs and a stomach. You, you, the jeans is just, some of these jeans got the long old cat and the flat top tail. Jeans, you never know what you're going to get. We are lucky to be living in a time where they put a whole lot of stretch in the jeans. But even then, you know, it's just the struggle is real in the jeans game. Already when I'm running my hands across this, I can tell it got more stretched than jean. Thank you. Um, I've had jeans like this before, made of this material, but I've heard good things about Boohoo jeans. These are, butt shaper high rise mid blue. I ain't know I was shaping my butt. What? I had to. I read that. So, okay. This is supposed to give me some lift and separate on the cheeks. We'll see. All right. Let's get into these jeans. You see me slinking up into the camera already. It's a tucker. I left my pajamas in. I'm wearing my pants over top of them. That's a rarity. This one did say it was going to lift and separate the cheeks. I, I see a little boost. This has so much stretch, and I'm into these all the way. No worries. Let me see if the next pair promise the same thing. Plus high-rise mom jeans. So what I think when I ordered these was that I was really pressed to get jeans that were going to come up high enough for me to wear a crop top. Like, when I'm wearing crops, I need that mess to meet. You can get the implication that it's crop because you see that shirt short and them pants is tall. But I don't always show my stomach when I do a crop. I don't know who Mama Jeans these is. But they are. So I'm not a fan of mom jeans per se. I got these because I was looking at the girl in the thing. But I mean, they mom jeans, mom ankle. 
Mom, my mom, my mom. My hope is that I'm going to be able to wear these with like a cuff. Or I might end up cutting them and distressing them because your mother would never. I, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. Okay. Next pair of jeans. As you can see, they are not buttoned up. Might not make it to be buttoned up. They don't have nearly as much stretch as the other jeans. But I figured I would still try to make it happen. One thing about these jeans I do want to say. Compared to the size of the jeans, the zipper is small. Any two times you got to put these jeans over top of stomachs and fat etc in your butt i'm gonna need a real sturdy zipper like i could barely feel the zipper you see me still so yeah i you know i jumped to get in my jeans but all i feel is pain because these things are not working uh-huh you see the look of frustration can't 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 stop won't stop so i don't know about y'all but I know these are rejects. They could have been, but they didn't quite make the cut. Ah, oh, well. We winding down. Are we winding down? Oh. We interrupt this regularly scheduled program because apparently I had the audacity to even buy some type of cosmetic from these folks. What this say? Oh, it said you can't get off of things. If you like me, you buy the same thing over and over and over and act like every time is the first time because I knew I got 50 limb of this color. I Heart Revolution Peach Liquid Lip Fleur. Fleurs. That's flower, right? Fleur. Flower. Sorry. Sorry. I must. <laughs> See, look at me giving you all that. Okay. I have to watch it real quick. Ain't that what y'all said to do? <sighs> Mad already. Ain't that crooked? Okay. Whatever. Yeah, as I thought, I got about 50 of these in this color. Does not smell like peaches, which would have been a great addition. They really be missing the mark with that. I need that stuff to smell good, have some kind of something to it since you're selling it. Marking it as peach. I get the color. Let me get a flavor. Okay, we got some more jeans. And those jeans. Cute. Got the little fray hem. What they say these are? Let's see. Power stretch, high rise, disco legging. How many of these things are true? Power stretch. She's stretching. High rise. The crotch is risen. Disco. I can neither confirm nor deny. Legging. No. But it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I don't care about that. I just care about if they slide on here and I can wear them. As I'm opening these jeans, I'm already fearing that this high waist is going to leave me with a Barney stomach, like when you jack them high waist pants up, and if you got a belly, the area from the waistband right at that fupa rim can be given real grimace in these high rise. So I don't know, but I'm burnt. I 
All right, I'm coming through with some all black jeans. Look, you can see the confidence. Uh, 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 kill them with a little bit of shoulder. And there you go. Once again, these failed zippers. I had them on. We was doing good. Then the zipper just said no. Nah. So the zipper was all the way up. And next thing I know is gapping at the top. I said it with the lash jeans. I don't know where they getting these zippers from. But this is not the YKK that I'm used to. Y'all got to do better with these fasteners on these jeans. Shame, shame, shame. Okay. We're down to our last two pieces. This look cute. Like, I already love this color. It's like kind of a minty green. I want this to be like a cute little romper or something like that. Is that what it's going to be? Don't know. Madonna. Don't even see. Okay, we got multiple pieces, so it's not a... Is it a sweatsuit? Okay, let's read the tag so I ain't got to do this. V-neck shirt and jogger set. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, that's really cute. Look, 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 look. No, this is cute. Okay, this is cute. It's a crop. No, it's, it's not even a crop, actually. It comes right to the waistline. That's cute. That's cute. But see, you get something like this. You got to be really careful. Not really careful. I'm saying it like it's life or death. But you just want to really judge this up. Like, whenever you're wearing these sweatsuits, it's easy to look soup sandwich. It's easy to look sloppy. So you want to make sure your accessories are on point. You want to figure out what your philosophy is with these rubber ankles. As for me in my house, I pull them up under the calf or mid-calf, let them drop like LL used to do, but I do it with both legs because I really don't want that bunch at the actual ankle. So that's how I do mine. I am probably going to find a cute sneaker or some kind of sandal. And I'm using those words loosely because I, I know you don't feel me because it's not a sandal because please no. I see y'all wearing these jogging suits with these clear heels. I guess I understand it. I don't recommend it. I, I just, I, that's me. I don't really want to wear a jogging suit with clear heels. I don't really know that aesthetic. I don't really understand it. That's y'all business and I'm a mind mind. So. Hmm. All I wanted to do was wear me a mint twin set like the rest of the girls. As you can see, this a mess. It is tight like hallways. Uh, You see that leg baggy at the bottom? Um, So I told you I was going to have to do the LL Cool J. I was going to have to ruch them legs up. And I did that. That helped. But, I mean, we can't deny the fact that this thing is a little small. So, this might be loungewear, too. I mean, this could be something to chill with. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to keep it. Yeah. Last but no drum roll. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me rewind the tape. I, okay. I don't want to be a fool again. So the last time I pulled out this red, I didn't even read this until now. Ruffle cold shoulder chiffon play suit. I don't recall this being a suit. When I try it on and drop it in here, maybe it'll be a suit. I ain't see where it had no legs. I'm going to be a devil in a red everything. Um, plus keyhole, huff sleeve, smock dress. This 
has some weight on it. So I'm gonna assume it's like it's 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 an experience, it's an, it's an outfit. Okay, that's the keyhole they were talking about. Once again, I ain't got too much to put around the keyhole, but mm, still I rise. Okay, let's see. She cute. I mean, yeah, 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 no, no, no. This is it, this is it, this is, it. This is a thing. She cute. That's not, but she cute. Okay. But see, y'all, listen, 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 listen. Don't cry for me, Argentina, but I can never get any titty reparations in these outfits. Like, what's going? What's going to go in there? What's going to go in there? Okay. Your girl favorite color is red, so we got another little red number, y'all. I like her. She cute. So I was complaining about that bus line, but that's not bad. I know it's a little gappy, but you got to work with what you got. Um, I think this is cute. I love that flare fit of it. I love the little accent in the back, little whole keyhole. That's nice. I, well, much to my chagrin, like some of these other outfits, no pockets. But I mean, I can take that on the chin. I just have to accessorize and carry me a little purse. I prefer pockets, but here we are. All right, so that felt like a thousand pieces of clothes to show y'all. COVID shopping, that's what I bought. Um, Next time you see this, you will see me with some of these items on. If for any reason you do not see them, I value your eyeballs, your retinas, your corneas, too much to put you through it but i'm gonna try to show all these outfits and yeah boohoo.com b-o-o-h-o-o.com is where i got these things from i'll put the link in the bottom so y'all can see i'm gonna try to itemize them but no i'm not i ain't even gonna lie i'm gonna put boohoo.com down there and y'all go forth be great shop for yourself this is the first of what i hope is many plus size hauls so you guys can see what's out there for the big girls for the big girls so yeah like subscribe turn on the notifications too because if you don't know when i'm on here how you gonna watch it and if you don't watch it how am i gonna know i'm reaching my people how am i gonna find who my people are until next time bye y'all